We're that big because we work with third party owners and so our strategy has been about going asset light and we've been selling off hotels for many years now. It's our 10th anniversary as an independent company and that's been our strategy. So the Mark Hopkins San Francisco Hotel is the latest disposal and we're, we're delighted to do that with a very, uh, very good owner who we've not worked with before. Um, but actually we, we think of ourselves as asset light but brand heavy and we invest heavily in our brands and you know, that's where the strength of the business now is and that's what encourages the guests that we have and the third party owners we work with. So what are you using the money for? Obviously as you say you're disposing of assets, you're raising quite a bit in the process, so where's the money going? Well we, we balance where we, where we uh, put the money. We've returned a lot of money to shareholders over the years but we've also invested heavily in the business in driving our brands and in technology. So we will continue with that balance and indeed we've got a buyback program underway now which uh, is uh, over $100 million still to do so we'll, we'll carry on with that. So you say you're giving quite a bit back to uh, shareholders and yet some stockbrokers, a few of you have, have downgraded you or if not have you on a neutral rating. When I look across the stockbrokers, they're not that excited about IHG at the moment. Why is that? I think uh, well, we're very excited about IHG. I think when you look at stockbrokers, they're making stock picking decisions and is your share price going to go up or down? And we've had a very strong run with the share, with the share price and we've driven a lot of shareholder return. And I guess we're, you know, we're steady as she goes. So you, you, you highlighted the numbers. We've seen a lot of growth. We've signed more hotels this year than we've signed for the last five years. We added 444 hotels into our pipeline and we opened 237. So there's a lot of steady growth in the business generate profit growth, generate increasing cash flow. So I think it's steady as she goes, but you know the share price has been quite strong and I guess they're taking a view on that. But we're a long-term business. We, we, we don't focus on, uh, on, on short-term things. 